all appeared in thereof. In the Coolmore Stud three year old power stakes, listed race. Again, just a bit with five furlongs and spread right across the track in these very early stages with showing speed and the red jacket Goran with right up prominent Miss Cogent with Merdiff just in behind. These are tracked through the first furlong and a half or so by Alphabet with the boss man and Kukri. Coming down now from the top of the course, and Miss Cogent over on the far side within the centre, Garon, and in between horses is Murdiv with improving alphabet. And then comes the boss man with Kukri, and Radio Silence is driven along at halfway with Mr. Scarlet on the outside of Cocalada. And then comes Childhood. Last at this stage is Psychedelic Funk as they begin the race to the final furling and a half, where Alphabet comes through to head Garon, and then comes Kukri, the boss man is next with Mayor Diff, Mr. Scarlet, and down the outside is Intelligence Cross with Kukri now on the far side coming home strongly for Colm O'Donoghue. Garon next with Alphabet and up towards the finish. Kukri for the trainer of the moment. Jessica Harrington has won the power stakes from Garon. And then came Intelligence Cross with Mr. Bossman and on the inside was Alphabet with Mr. Scarlet. They're off. In the listed Coolmore Stud European Breeders Fund Sansible Stakes, over 10 furlongs, and the first to show was Oh Grace on the inside of Pocketful of Dreams, with a couple of lengths back to Key to My Heart. And Queen Anne's Lace is fourth, with Aurora Butterfly on the inside of She's Ranger. Butterflies is next, being followed down the far side by Bengala, and towards the rear, Vociferous Marina and Bound. Racing now just outside the seven furlong point, and O'Grace takes them along, leads a length with Pocketful of Dreams, about two and a half lengths in front of Stable Companion Key to My Heart, and then on the outside she's Ranger, who races in company with Queen Anne's Lace as they continue on now towards the six. They're just a furlong outside the halfway point with in the lead O'Grace and Ronan Whelan, followed by Pocketful of Dreams and Donnock O'Brien, three lengths to Key to My Heart and Wayne Lorden with She's Ranger and Robson Aguilar on the outside of Queen Anne's Lace and Pat Smullen. Then comes Bengala, who's up between Butterflies and Aurora Butterfly on the inside, and then Vociferous Marina and Bound. They're past the halfway stage and there's been little change with O'Grace joined off the home turn by Pocketful of Dreams still this break of over three lengths to key to my heart as they straighten up for home she's ranger is next with queen anne's lace over on the inside the black cap with butterflies and aurora butterfly and then bengala vociferous marina and bound there inside the three and pocket full of dreams hits the front from she's ranger with making ground in between horses key to my heart oh grace has dropped out then butterflies queen anne's lace has come under pressure and then aurora butterfly and down the outside is vociferous marina Arena, racing to the final furlong and the leader is pocket full of dreams out to and front vociferous marina is aiding up the ground on the near side and from the back of the field vociferous marina and kevin manning have wore them all down in the sensible stakes and goes on to win for jim bulger pocket full of dreams second and then bengala with she's ranger on the inside of aurora butterfly would bound next Seven runners locked away. They're off. 
as they race up towards the stands first time in the group three Coolmore Vintage Crop Stakes over a mile and six and it's Red Stars who disputes the early running with alongside Torquador a couple of lengths back to Twilight Payment with in fourth place Order of St George, Lustrous Light, Dewline and bringing up the rear Morga. As the seven runners come up now to pass the winning post, a circuit in front of them and striding on by under two lengths is Torquador and Cullum O'Donoghue to lead. Red Stars, Declan McDonough second, Twilight Payment, Kevin Manning in third with Order of St. George and Shamie Heffernan just fourth on the inside of Lustrous Light, Colin Keane. Two lengths to Dewline, ridden by Gary Carroll and the back marker, Morga and Ronan Whelan. Racing along the side of the course and turning now at the 10 furlong point to make their way into the back straight. In the lead is Torquador, followed in second place by Red Stars. Third is Twilight Payment with Order of St. George in fourth. Lustrous Light is then being followed by Dewline and Morga as they race across from the stands towards the final nine furlongs. Little change from first to last, Torquador makes it. Twilight Payment has just moved second on the outside of Red Stars with Order of St. George at clear fourth. Lustrous Light, Dewline and Morgan as they continue on now to reach the final mile with Torquador the leader by a little over a length to Twilight Payment. In third place is Red Stars who's tracked by Order of St. George, last season's Ascot Gold Cup winner, as three behind Lustrous Light, Dewline and finally Morgan. They're racing inside the seven and continuing towards the end of the back straight with Torquador continuing to lead. Twilight Payment on the outside of Red Stars with Order of St. George in fourth, Lustrous Light, Dewline and Morga. They're coming across now towards the final five furlongs and they're well past the halfway stage in the Coolmore Vintage Crop Stakes. In the lead is Torquador Twilight Payment on the outside of Red Stars being followed by Order of St. George who continues in that fourth spot. Lustrous Light a length and a half behind him and then Dewline and Morgan they're homeward bound with four furlongs to race. Torquador and Colm O'Donoghue in front of Twilight Payment pushed along by Kevin Manning on the outside. Order of St. George and Red Stars come next with Lustrous Light Dewline line and Morg as they come down from the top of the hill and Torquador is trying to stretch them out here. Twilight Payment being followed by Order of St. George in the middle of the track. Wider still is Lustrous Light and then Red Stars and Morg at Dewline is out of it. Racing inside the two. Torquador with Twilight Payment in the centre. Order of St. George is running on in the middle of the track and then Lustrous Light with Red Stars. They're spread across the track now as they race to the final 200 yards. Torquador is still in front. Order of St. George is trying to quicken up on the near side of Twilight Payment but it's Torquador all the way in the Colmore Vintage Crop Stakes a fine double for Colm O'Donoghue and Jessica Haddington. Order of St George then came Twilight Payment, Morgan Lustrous, Light Red Stars and a long way behind Dewline.